Hi, my peeps. What's up, Wagwan? Welcome back to your girl, Tiona, in the house. Yes, yes, yes. And guys, please remember, leave me a little bit of like and subscribe for other amazing content. And guys, everybody loved the banana bread I made the other day. And one of my followers, um, Miss B, big up yourself, Miss B. She wants me to make a banana zucchini bread with some chopped um, walnut and some dates. All right, guys. So I have zucchini here and I'm going to try to get about a cup. She also said I must use coconut flour. I already have coconut flour. But guys, when you use coconut flour, it doesn't bind. There's no binding agent. It's just like shredded coconut and it then mince it out. So that's what they call coconut flour. I have one cup of all-purpose flour and I'm going to add half cup of my coconut um, flour and it's organic. Half cup of that. Now we're going to put some spice. I'm going to add half teaspoon mace. You can add whatever you want guys. Half teaspoon nutmeg. We're going to also add half teaspoon cinnamon. Half is good. Too much salt, not good for you guys. Half teaspoon salt. I'm going to add half teaspoon baking soda. And we're going to add one and a half teaspoon baking powder. That's it. Now we're going to sieve it together. This part is the coconut flour, guys. So make sure it's out and the spices. I have one zucchini and I'm going to shred it, okay? I'm going to use this part here. So you need one of this okay it's like a small one same bowl I just transfer the ingredients here um, I'm gonna do my bananas two bananas you want them ripe I'm gonna add only half cup of brown sugar why because I have the bananas and I have my dates so you don't need a lot of sugar. So I'm gonna do half cup of brown sugar. You can use granulated sugar guys, but the brown sugar is good. You're gonna give it a nice brown color. A little bit more. That's half cup, yeah, half cup, that's it. I'm gonna go in with half cup of extra virgin olive oil, okay? You can use any oil of your choice. That's good. You need the oil guys and you need healthy oil and olive oil is healthy. Now we're gonna mush this. <laughs> mush that together. Easy peasy guys, homemade. And if you don't want the banana too mushy, you leave it a little bit chunky. This is super healthy, all right? And that's it, I don't wanna crush it out anymore. I'm gonna break my eggs, all right? I'm gonna break them one at a time. You can use two or three eggs. It's up to you. And I'm gonna take the whites out. I'm gonna go in with three eggs, guys. Taking my whites out. Come on, don't lose. Hey. I gotta find it, guys, sorry. There. I'm gonna add a little bit of lemon zest. We're gonna zest it before I add it there. That's good, guys. Give this a little bit so we can zest it so it takes away the rawness out of the egg. You can add some lemon or lime juice if you want as well. All right, and I'm gonna pour it in my mixture there. A tablespoon of molasses, optional. That's gonna have a little bit of sweetness to it as well. One teaspoon vanilla. You can measure guys i just judge the thing ha one teaspoon i'm an extra 
Oh, it smells so good. Half teaspoon mixed essence or half cup. Oh my God, that smells like ice cream. Half teaspoon rose water. Guys, this is our secret. I'm gonna put a tablespoon of rum. Don't tell nobody, guys. It's a secret. That help with the rawness with the egg, okay? Remember. Now I'm gonna add a quarter cup of apple sauce. That's gonna, oh, I can't pull it, guys. I'm only gonna go in with quarter cup. Quarter cup of apple sauce. Help to add moisture to it. Now I'm gonna go in with some almond and coconut milk. And I'm gonna put half cup. That will do. And that's it, nothing else. We're gonna give this a little mix. See guys, just one mixture. You don't have to waste your time. And that's it. Now I'm gonna add my flour mixture in two portion. Oh, it smells so good, full of flavor. And you don't wanna over mix it, all right? And I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna measure it out for you. We want one cup. I'm only gonna go in with one cup today, okay guys? See, whoa, I measure it one cup. Gonna add that to that. And over here I have half cup of chopped walnut. And what I did guys, I just, um, you can chop it with your hands or you can put it in the food processor. Either or, it doesn't matter. And this is one third of um, chopped dates. I'm gonna fold everything in together, okay guys? And remember you're making a bread. You don't want it too watery, okay? You want it moist. And it, I think it's actually a cake too guys. They just call it bread. So you want to fold it in, give it a little mix, okay, and that's it. Mix up the bottom too. All right, we're going to pop this in the oven, and that's it. A little bit of olive oil to the bottom. I'm going to just set some greasy paper in the bottom. And we're gonna pour the rest over in this one. This is it, shake, shake, shake. And I'm gonna pop them in the oven and I'll come back. And as I said, the oven is preheating at 350 degrees Fahrenheit. And I think I'm gonna bake them for about an hour. If it's more or less, I'll let you know. You want to leave them in there for about hour and 10 minutes but depending on your oven temperature you can maybe do a, an hour or so a tablespoon of honey here you don't even have to use the tablespoon of honey guys just a little bit see still have a lot just a little bit you need maybe about a teaspoon and a little bit Oh wow guys look at that super moist super soft oh wow that's how it's looking guys wow really good mm. it's super super soft oh my goodness mm. 
and this is the healthier choice okay guys i didn't add much sugar and i made two mm -mm. and look at the top there it is oh my goodness guys this is super yummy mm. this is good for breakfast lunch or dinner or if you just want to have a snack the healthier choice okay guys don't add a lot of sugar and the um, olive oil the coconut flour all of those are healthier choice and the fruits in it mm, and the nuts yeah lots of nuts <laughs> And the, the zucchini actually tastes good, guys, with it. Mmm, come in with the banana flavor. Really good. You should give this a try. First time I'm making. All right, Miss B. So this is what I get from it, okay? All right, guys, you love upon me, and I love upon you. Have a good day. Something up all over there. All right, guys, we're going to taste the bad boy here. Oh, my goodness. Mm -mm. Super soft. And super moist. And it's not sweet, guys. You should give it a try. Super healthy recipe. Thanks, Miss B. Bye, guys. Mm -mm.